What's up guys, Alon Gonzalez with MuscleMonsters.com Sunday vlog and today's just going to be a quick update day but before I get into that let me just show you what I'm having for breakfast. First I got my shake, it's a scoop and a half of whey, got peanut butter in there and I also have some spinach. Alright, and then I got two eggs, they are fried but they are fried on the pan with Pam on it so it's zero calorie. And then same goes for the two slices of turkey bacon and two slices of wheat bread. Alright guys, that's it for now. Alright guys, you just saw what I had for breakfast. And now I want to give you a quick update on my training. You see, last week, or I guess you could say this weekend, was supposed to be my deload. Um, for my training, but instead what I did was I just I'm taking the days off I'm getting about five days Consecutive of just full rest no gym at all um, I've been pushing myself extremely hard in the gym to hit those PRs and It's just it's just taking a toll on my body and I can kind of feel it when I go to the gym so I thought it was best that I just completely rest and then I'll be back in the gym in about two days. So I'm excited for that. Also, I'm very proud to announce that I just launched my 42-day primal chest. And this is a chest specialization program for anybody who's having trouble building their pecs. I'll put a link in the description so you can check that out. And then real quick, I want to show you guys an awesome home chest workout. It's only right that it's a chest workout considering I just put out my chest program. But this is a chest workout and I'll show you now. What you want to do is you want to just lay flat on your back um, and you want to, it's basically just like a regular dumbbell press except for since you're doing it on the floor uh, there's going to be no elastic tension. So when you bring the weight down you come to a complete stop, a dead stop, and then you push up. And this is going to help preserve the shoulder for anybody who's having shoulder problems, as well as put some more tension on the chest without using momentum. All right? So just a quick uh, workout that you can add to your home or gym training arsenal. All right? It doesn't have to replace your dumbbell presses. It's just another way of doing it. All right, guys. See you later. What's going on, guys? So, I have some good news and I have some bad news. I'll start with the bad news. I, uh, a lot of you guys have noticed that I haven't been wearing my wedding ring lately. And unfortunately, it's simply because, as I mentioned before, I've gained about 17 pounds since my last cut. So it no longer fits. Now, I could probably get it on there, but getting it off is always a task, so I don't wear it too often. Um, I could go get it resized, but then once I start cutting, it's going to be big, and then I'll have to get it resized again, and so on and so forth. My wife doesn't make a big deal out of it because we've been together for nearly 10 years, so it's not a huge deal, but uh, that's why I haven't been wearing it that often in my videos. So, no big deal there. Now for the good news. I know you guys have been patiently waiting for me to put out some new gym workouts. Actual footage from the gym. And the reason I haven't been able to, which I've mentioned before, is because, number one, my camera broke, so I've been using my iPhone for footage. And number two, most importantly, I don't train with anybody anymore. I strictly train alone and I have nobody to film me. But Brandon Campbell from Campbell Fitness, and I'll put his link in the description, awesome fitness YouTube channel, so definitely check that out. Um, I watched one of his videos and he talked about a gorilla pod. And basically what this is, is it a tiny tripod that you can actually manipulate to 
you know, hang on to maybe gym equipment. Um, it's even small enough to just put on the floor and angle it however which way I want to, to, to film myself basically without getting in anybody's way. So, now that I have this and now that I have my new camera, I will start filming footage in the gym as soon as I get back in there in two days. So, this week, I guarantee new gym footage for you guys. So, there you have it guys. Then one last thing, I was looking in my computer just kind of looking at old footage and I have two tricep exercises that I want to share with you guys. Um, they're not very common and that's the reason I want to show you guys. They're nothing special, they're just something different, something you can add into your routine if you're doing the same old boring workouts. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and show you clips of each one. Check them out. Tone Blair, who we got here? My Crane, Illustrate, Cap Callis, Johnny Storm, Spit Camp in the building. Rugged, rugged. Hey yo, don't lose yourself trying to prove yourself amateur. Feel lucky yeah. and place your bets. Uh -huh. Brace yourself when you face the set. I've been facing vets breaking necks since the age of 12. Hip hop never died after taking sets. It just faked his death. Yeah. Which is ironic because all that bullshit that was claimed the best was a waste of breath. Now that it's laid, the rest is back in a different. Alright, guys, there you have it. That's my Sunday vlog. And make sure to like the video if you want to keep seeing these Sunday vlogs. Also, if you want more videos and you want to stay tuned on the next workout videos I'm going to be putting out, make sure to subscribe. And if you are a naturally skinny guy like myself who wants to put on some muscle, download my free guide, Mass in a Flash. It's a 12-week guide. It's got your diet, your workout routine, and some extra tips in there, and it's totally free. I'll put a link in the description for that, and until next time, I'll see you guys.